Hi, my name is Ray Chambers and I'm an ICT teacher at Lodge Park Technology College in Corby, Northamptonshire in England. Now, some of you have said to me while using some of my tutorials that you've had problems with it actually running. So what I'm going to show you is how to get around the problem with the Coding for Fun toolkit that everyone's getting. Now, I've downloaded the Coding for Fun toolkit and I've also downloaded one of my sample applications. Now, if I right click on that and I'm just going to open with Explorer and I'm just going to extract it. Yes, I'm happy with that. Once it's extracted, I'm just going to open it up. Alright. So if I go into my digestive system, open it up. The first thing that many people will notice is that they're having a problem in the designer and that they can't view it. And I have exactly the same problem, but I'm going to show you how to get around it. So, if I double click on the main window, this will open up the designer. Or and you'll have this problem, and you'll also say that it's not running at the bottom. So what I do, is I go up to my references, and I remove Coding for Fun Win Form, Coding for Fun Connect, and Microsoft Expression Drawing. And all I do is I add them back in. So if I right click on References and Add Reference, all I need to do is browse to the desktop, where I've got my files so I called it coding for fun there it is if I double click on that or highlight all of those and press OK it won't fix it right away as you've noticed down there, but if you run your program it will work and then all you do is you press stop And if you reload the designer, you'll be able to edit it again. Now, this warning here, don't worry too much about. You c all it is is to do with the new connect. So if my program was made in beta 1, it might say that there's an error warning. But you can double click on it. Or I'm just going to take you there. All it is, is this. And to fix it, all you do is delete that. Put dot connects. Move that. press play and it will still work and if you look that's all your warnings gone I hope that's helped you run some of the applications that are in my folders